Hello, it is me, Austin. So, I did, I watched Stravinsky's Firebird Suite, and I enjoyed it a lot. It was a very fun piece of music. Turn on my microphone. Um, to start off, I have notes. It's a longer one, so I had to keep track of what was going on. I couldn't remember everything. So, anyway, it started off kind of dark and foreboding. It was, um, I don't know how to really describe it. Um, there was a lot of, it was a lot of low winds. Kind of made you feel uneasy. There was cello parts and the string bass. There wasn't anything really kind of happy and light. It was just all kind of dark, obviously, dark and foreboding. Duh. But anyway, so, and I, that carries on for like five, like four or five minutes. And then, um, well, also it, it goes on for a while and then some flutes start coming in and the flutes kind of punctuate a very uneasy feeling. It's mixing with the low winds that like, that's... <laughs> the bass clarinet, bassoon, um, the flute just sounds very strange with all the rest of those. It's, it's nice, but strange. And then it starts getting crazy. The um, string, the violins really join in and they're pitzing and it just sounds super chaotic. It's just going nuts. And then after, as that go pa that passes and this is like a six seven minute mark kind of then it just becomes peaceful it kind of it resolves the chaos builds and then it just resolves and then um there's parts with the oboe and the violins and it's just very peaceful melodic and that goes on and then right about like the 10 minute mark, it just, there's just a BAM, loud brass, and it's really fast tempo. And the trumpets have a really fun part. It's kind of like a fanfare almost, but not really, I suppose, if that makes sense. But they, it's definitely really fun. And then it goes back to calm and flowy after that big loud burst. And there's flutes in there, and all the there's oboe parts are really cool. And right near the end, there is um, an F horn solo. When I first heard it, I'm like, oh, that sounds cool, like a trombone. But no, it was F horn. It was very cool. I really liked the solo horn. It sounded amazing. And right near the end, there was kind of fanfare to like a send-off almost since this is firebird i would assume it's like a phoenix i guess and so like a phoenix you have your calm uh you start off it's all evil and harsh at the beginning and then the phoenix burns away turns to ash and then it's all peaceful and calm as the phoenix is starting to get reborn. And then burst, he's alive. He's all happy. And then um, the calm, he's settling back down. And then there's that fanfare. It's like the cycle start all over again. I may be reading too much into it. That's my guess. But one thing that I noticed about the ending, I know we talked about this on Friday, um, how John Williams likes to steal stuff. And the ending was very, felt very much like one of John Williams' pieces. It kind of sounded like the ending to E.T. almost, because it just ends on a really uplifting note. It doesn't really just go down a solid tonic. But I enjoyed this piece. I took a look at the discussions, and I saw a few other people did this, so I'll be looking at them. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed your videos.